thanks a lot for staying with us here at CNN News 18. You're watching the Super Saturday Debate with me, Ridhima Bhatnagar. A series of videos have now emerged from the Tihar Jail where Delhi Minister Satyendra Jain can be seen getting massages as he continues to be an inmate. The jail Delhi Minister can be seen interacting with people, having access to mineral water, even going through some files. The BJP and the Congress are now demanding Satyendra Jain to be sacked for flouting rules and pressurizing jail authorities to indulge in such acts. The Aam Aadmi Party has hit back claiming that Satyendra Jain is a patient and he has had surgeries in the past and this is just physiotherapy. Will this now be a flashpoint for the upcoming MCD polls? Is this politics or property? That's the larger question. Here's the story first. Delhi's Cabinet Minister Satyendra the Jain is now surrounded by yet another controversy. New videos have now emerged which show Satyendra the Jain getting a special treatment while being an inmate at the Tihar Jail. CCTV footage shows Satyendra the Jain getting a full body massage while locked up at Tihar Jail. Video also shows a carton of mineral water and a TV remote on the bed. Not only this, Jain can also be seen reading some documents. Tihar Jail comes under the Delhi government and that is why Arvind Kejriwal and company is under massive fire. The BJP went all guns blazing against the AAP government. The BJP believes that jail manuals were violated by the Kejriwal government. The BJP has even asked why Satyendra Jain, who also has corruption charges against him, was still a cabinet minister. This video ko dekhne ke baad... ये आम आदमी पार्टी नहीं है ये पार्टी है बदनाम दाम पार्टी नॉट ओनली द बीजेपी बट द कांग्रेस हैज आल्सो रेज सम सीरियस क्वेश्चंस ऑन दिल्लीज आम आदमी पार्टी गवर्नमेंट आफ्टर दिस मसाज वीडियो वेंट वायरल कह रहे थे हम राजनीति बदलने आए हैं हम सुख सुविधाएं सरकारी नहीं लेंगे बंगला नहीं लेंगे गाड़ी नहीं लेंगे लेकिन आज जेल में सत्येंद्र जैन तीन महीने से जेल में है तिहाड़ जेल में और जेल के अंदर भी सुख सुविधाएं लेने से इतना भी कतरा नहीं रहे हैं आज नैतिकता कहाँ है अरविंद केजरीवाल जी दिल्ली पूछ रही है According to the Aam Aadmi Party, Satyendra Jain is undergoing a treatment for spine injury and the doctor had prescribed him regular physiotherapy. The Aam Aadmi Party has now blamed the opposition for doing low-level politics. The Bharti Janta Party has so much hurt and hurt that no one has given the disease of any person in his disease and the disease of the disease of his disease CCTV footage गलत तरीके से बाहर निकाल के उसको मनोहर कहानियां सुना सुना के आज किसी की बीमारी का मजाक बना रहे हैं लोग। The video emerges just days after the Tihar jail superintendent was also suspended for providing special treatment to Satyendra Jain. About 12 officials were also transferred last week for the same. But now the question arises that was all the rejig in the jail administration just a facade? Well, that really is the larger question. And before I bring in my guests, I quickly want to show you which are these videos that have emerged from Tihar Jail. This is Satyendra Jain. He's still a minister as far as the Delhi government is concerned. You can see he's interacting with multiple people at the same time. He has access to mineral water. He's getting massages as he continues to be an inmate at the Tihar Jail. He's also going through some files and documents. A TV remote can be seen as well. The Aam Aadmi Party here is saying... All of this is part of physiotherapy, but we've spoken to a lot of doctors and experts who are actually questioning this procedure being called physiotherapy. Let me bring in my guests at this point. We have the spokesperson of the BJP, R.P. Singh. We have the Congress spokesperson, Gaurav Pandi. We also have a political analyst, Sayyid Abbas, Deshrat and Nigam, lawyer and political analyst, also now joining us. We also have Sunil Kumar Gupta, Tihar's former legal advisor. Gentlemen, good to have all of you on the broadcast with us. Sunil Kumar, I'd like to begin the conversation with you. The videos that we've seen all through the day. Sure, sure. The videos that we've seen all through the day as far as Satyendra Jain getting these head massages, having access to a multiple people at the same time. Is this a regular protocol? No, no, this is not the regular protocol. Uh, basically, you know, when uh, we see this massage video, 
here we find that they are applying the oil on his head and you see in the this uh, physiotherapy oil is never applied uh, i am sure that this is massage massage which is being uh, done by the by the uh, three inmates and uh, this uh, massage this is not uh, 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 allowed in the jail manual in the jail manual this is uh, totally prohibited because here we are using the prisoner labor for some private work under the jail manual we can't uh, uh, take the labor of the uh, prisoner for private work they can be used only for the government work hmm. so here clearly uh, there is the violation of uh, the prison rules and uh, uh, not permissible Sayyid Abbas, you heard from uh, Sunil Kumar, he's Tihar's former legal advisor. This is not physiotherapy, this is what most doctors have also said. And this is not where physiotherapy is given if an inmate is prescribed that by the doctor. Also, what explains mineral water, a television remote, multiple people at the same time and that inmate. Yes, he's a minister, but he's an inmate as of now going through files and documents as well. Rudima ji, I've always believed my good friend of the BJP, R.P. Singh Sahab is also here. He's aware of my testimony that Hakikat chup nahi sakti chupane se, mehk ut nahi sakti kagaz ke khunne se. The fact of the matter, I was on several uh, national media channels and I've uh, said the same thing. The fact we need to understand this person, Satyander Jain uh, had a fall in the jail due to which he had to undergo a surgery, two spinal surgeries for which the doctor prescribed him complete physiotherapy and treatment. And let me know, uh, I challenge any doctor on the panel, which, who would say that there is no massage in a, a physiotherapy session. There could be different forms. There could be a different uh, uh, set of procedure, but it is absolutely okay. Now coming to the bisleri water is provided, any jail authority, even in the manual book, the legal advisor can also correct me if I'm wrong. When the doctor prescribes you, of mineral water due to your health deteriorating conditions, it is absolutely allowed. Now the Bharatiya Janata Party wants to quickly take away the distraction politics from the people of Gujarat elections, also the MCD elections. They are scared today. Why? Because they will lose the elections today. So therefore, the real question is, how did they get such privy confidential videos? Is the CCTV for internal security or is it for the BJP? Are how does BJP respond to the again allegations that's coming in from the Ahmadmi Party? Uh, I'd also like to say we did invite the Ahmadmi Party, but they have uh, not joined the panel. But RP Singh, the question that is being raised by the Ahmadmi Party, one, they're saying that there are certain prescriptions that were given to Satyendra Jain. So is the BJP really mocking somebody's illness? And the other question, as Saeed Abbas has also raised, that how did you even get access to a video that is only privy to officials as far as Tihar is concerned? Well, uh, I will start here with a little lighter vein. Mr. Satyendra recently said that he's lost memory and probably uh, he was being given a head massage or champi in Hindi is called by, in, by a badam rogan so that he can get his memory back. But that point aside, the issue is this uh, whole of this thing which they are saying that uh, th this happened, his operation happened on so and so date and thereafter he was prescribed the physiotherapy. I have gone through the document, that paper, that paper is with me, 23rd September, the doctor prescribed him the physiotherapy. He fell down. He fell down on 15th. He was hospitalized after that. But this video which you are uh, running is of 13 September. So let's know. I mean, what sort of physiotherapy it is? 13 September. He fell down on uh, later on, and he was operated on 23rd and, and given uh, prescribed physiotherapy on 23rd. So we all know they are trying to cover up. The fact is that he is using the jail as his personal freedom and then he's using a jail as a probably a farmhouse where he can enjoy all the facility which he probably use as a as an individual when he's uh, out in open but it's not only that it's, okay. it doesn't confine to that the risk is much more because give me a second if if you are using jail for all these objectives tomorrow and then obviously the jail authorities or the other in inmates will know everyone will know True. about it 
tomorrow someone can bribe the jail authorities which has been there and then can Just use this for many other objectives no the point the that rp singh is, is raising is complete. also very Please. very important because a lot of questions now being raised as far as the role of the tihar officials also are concerned and oh. i'll come back to that in just a bit but gorav i also want to bring you in isn't this a complete misuse as far as the power of the minister is concerned because he was a jail minister so he would have known the protocols uh, absolutely it's it's uh, blatant misuse of power because the department of prison comes under delhi government and said in that then himself is the jail minister and you know aap has uh, the question is always raised that uh, they came saying that they will change the politics yes aap has definitely changed the politics because what we only saw in in films in uh, till now Uh, that how uh, you know uh, the p- prisons are misused by uh, the p- politicians for the first time in the history of independent Indi- india we are seeing visuals like that where uh, a minister is getting a luxurious treatment in the in the jail and what is even more worrying is then a few weeks ago when these uh, allegations came into light about the uh, uh, satender jain receiving massage services uh the aam aadmi party and especially the chief minister of delhi categorically denied they held press conferences and yeah. after that on various political platforms he went on to say that nothing of as such is happening mm-hmm. uh, in inside the jail and today we have the visuals in front of us yeah. what does that tell us that the chief minister blatantly without blinking his eyelids has been lying to the people of delhi and it's shocking because you know come to think of it what else these people must be hiding and uh, who else they must be providing these services well, today the again party uh, they feel that they lie because they feel there is a medical condition and that is being misused by political I'm parties coming. today but they shut the nigam i want to bring you in however way or whichever way the aam aadmi party today wants to defend themselves it is going to be extremely difficult because you know just a couple of weeks ago you had seen a rejig as far as the tihar administration is concerned after very serious allegations came to light now the larger question is was all of that still a facade if all of this continued in the premises the other is this man satender jain who's an inmate as of now still continues to be a minister wouldn't it just be easier for the aam aadmi party to ask satender jain to step down and let the investigation be complete yes ritima in fact first and foremost thing he should not have been a minister as of now he has been there for a long time and he is under judicial custody please remember one thing is very important therefore the courts should have taken so much notice he is not under delhi police's custody he is under judicial custody so courts have to take some action on their own secondly the uncontrolled access of so many people to that person is itself a very worrisome point because a person meets the uh, inmate only on the permission of the court and then also one at a one at a time and not more than one or two person can meet in a day here you see a group of people sitting there i don't know what they are discussing files and documents are also there then there is a possibility of if so many people are who are they we don't know and the possibility of influencing the witness destruction of evidence through instructions of these people who are there inside may affect the case also and he is a repeat offender oh. similar similar actions have led to suspension in the past but again yeah. probably a worse kind of visuals has now come out about massage and doctors opinion probably will prevail over say the bars when they say the oil cannot be used and therefore there are various other issues head yeah. massage and everything which is going on yeah. these are privilege sayed the bars li- absolutely i agree sayed the bars this is what i'm saying even if i keep the angle of physiotherapy and the massage aside and i say that okay there are different types of physiotherapies that are given and the doctors can debate it because they'll have the final word but still what explains as i said you have mineral water bottles i don't know if other inmates if they're getting something similar there is remote as far as the television is concerned please tell me whether inmates are getting it multiple people in the cell at the same time please tell me whether inmates are getting it and more importantly what are these documents that satender jain is also seen reading tell me if the other inmates also have the same privileges ridima ji first and foremost we don't really know what documents it is so i understand we can raise our respective questions coming to this lady have made it clear if the doctor has prescribed him due to his deteriorating mental uh, for his health conditions it is allowed as in the manual of the jail course book now the straight answer to your question here is we need to understand there is much larger layer of conspiracy here 
इंटरनल सिक्योरिटी के लिए होता है सीसीटीवी हाउ डज द भारतीय जनता पार्टी गेट एक्सेस टू इट इट्स नॉट फॉर पब्लिक कंजम्पन एंड लो एंड बिहोल्ड एवरी सिंगल डेली बीजेपी लीडर हैज एक्सेस एंड स्प्रेडिंग ऑन सोशल मीडिया एंड थ्रू द नेशनल मीडिया are they also bribing the jail authorities or what is the picture is not just cbi idit which is caged parrots or it is more agencies too also as a matter of fact the threat of the aam aadmi party in gujarat and delhi and but that's the same question that the bjp is also today raising that is the aam aadmi party bribing officials satyendra jain was a jail minister is he using his past influence as far as personal in the tihar jail are concerned absolutely so not so i'm sure. just trying to understand shouldn't the aam aadmi party and the chief minister arvind kejriwal just come out and apologize that yes flouting of protocol has taken place because videos and visuals speak a larger story than what me and you say rhythma ji we also need to understand here the larger conspiracy let me challenge my friend rp singh and tell him how did you get the access to the videos what is your connection or the nexus with the jail authorities and the bjp we need to know because these people have taken over government agencies like it's their own home how does me a citizen of this country not lose faith in the cbi id it now even jail bataiye aapko main challenge deta hu rp singh sahab wo sawal to main rp singh se pooch lungi sayed abbas but jo sawal main pooch rahi hu main samajhna chahti hu ki privilege baki inmates ko to nahi mil raha hai to in minister ko kaise mil raha hai but rp singh respond to the allegation that how did the bjp even get hold of this video I'll appreciate it. Ma, ask your research team to find out. The videos were not released by BJP, but by media house. One, second, media agency. I'm so sorry. Who Secondly, gave it to the media house, Paji? The core question Paji, is why can I complete? Let let Arpi Singh finish his point. I didn't steal your money, sir. 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 I didn some other award to the other guys so dia because they all three put together hold key to that money bag and which is being used in elections in gujarat in 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 himachal which was used in goa they the these are the three people who hold the key to one key to the money bag and mr kejriwal will never sack neither sosodia neither mr uh, uh, satyendra jain he did so with the other person in uh, punjab Mr. In Punjab, but he won't dare to do so because he knows the day he does that, a lot of things will tumble against him also. And also, this gentleman named Shu uh, Kumar, who has been again and again saying that money has been taken from him in jail, mm. and because of that, one of the highest officer of the jail has been transferred. Mm. There are inquiry against eighty people, and the money is no less is ten crore, twelve and half crore, and fifty crore. Mm. He is saying, giving details. I give a challenge otherwise. Let Mr. Kejriwal be prepared for a light rated test. Mr. Mr. Sohdia Sinder Jain okay. and Mr. Kalash Goat Gallod okay. all be prepared for the light rector test okay. and let this happen. So big questions that are being Wait asked by the Wait BJP that how come these privileges we given and more importantly why isn't Arvind Kejriwal asking Satyendra Jain to step down as a minister? Unfortunately, I've completely run out of time. We had limited time. I apologize to our panelists. I'll have to leave that conversation there. We'll keep tracking all those developments. We quickly also shifting our focus to some other breaking developments coming. This is a CNN News 18 mega exclusive. We are now understanding Harvinder Singh Rinda is critical at a hospital in Lahore. Top intelligence sources are telling us that the wanted terrorist was admitted at the Jinnah Hospital in Lahore due to an overdose of drugs. Later, he got transferred to the CMH Lahore. Currently, there is no information about his death so far from Pakistan or from his family. Let me bring in my colleague Tejinder Singh Sodhi, who is joining us on the broadcast. Tejinder, what's the latest update? Uh, see, Ridma, uh, the uh, the reports which we have accessed are uh, investigating editor Manoj Gupta has accessed that uh, Harvinder Singh Rinda, a notorious uh, Khalistani terrorist who has been living in Pakistan, he is a uh, serious, he is a wanted terrorist and a known gangster who is responsible for several terror-related incidents in Punjab. He is also responsible. for carrying out several target killings across Punjab which include uh, the killing of Sidhu Musewala and several such killings across uh, Punjab now uh, the sources are telling our investigating editor that uh, gangster Rinda uh, was admitted in Jinnah Hospital Lahore due to a drug overdose and uh, then later he was shifted to CMH that is a military hospital in Lahore uh, and was referred there by the doctors at the Jinnah Hospital uh so far uh, there is no confirmation whether uh, he is alive or dead okay. uh, but uh, uh, but there are unconfirmed reports coming from pakistan that uh, he has some uh, this is 
uh, the Davinder uh, Bhandia group, okay. which is a rival group of Rinda group, they are claiming that okay. they have killed Rinda, but the confirmation from Pakistan or his family okay. is still awaited. Yes. Okay, Tejinder, thanks a lot for getting us all those details. We'll keep tracking all these developments. Unfortunately, we've completely run out of time. It's a wrap from my side. Thanks a lot for watching.